Hello, Darth Vegan here, back with more Clash of Kings, a Mountain Blade modification. I don't remember what was going on last time, because quite frankly, it's been a while since I played. And yeah, I could have just went and looked at my last video, but that would require me to do some work. And I am lazy, you guys. Lazy. So, I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm going to have to uh, kind of ride around and and see what's going on. I think uh, I think I was going to go and try to retrieve some of my friends from uh, Lord Haraway's town. I believe is what I kind of had in store for myself. Ooh, elite Westerlands men at arms. Wow, that might be tough. Let's take it on. Let's just check it out here. Hmm. Oh, I wonder if I can make them join my party. That would be excellent. 5,000 gold for 55 elite western... I think I'll do it. I will do it. My current action is disgraceful. I lost 102 renown. Oh my god. Wow, why is it so disgraceful to take broken men in? What's my renown now? Uh, 617, holy jeez. That's terrible. <laughs> At least my honor is still good. Okay, well, now, now I know. Now I know. Um, I'm king of Conceria. Okay, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yes. Mm -hmm. Yep. I don't. I still don't have any enemies. That's interesting. Okay, so I've got. I'm up to 220 guys now. And let's ride over here to. Um, Brendan Tully. Oh, that's Edward Tully. Let's go over here to... Oh, hi! Who we got here? Sir Gregor Kilgain. Oh, lordy mama! Woo! 543 troops for the king here. Okay, let's see who's in prison. Uh, Gerald Dane. Bloodbeard. Balakwo. Okay, so... Both Bloodbeard and Balakwo are in prison at uh, Lord Haraway's town. However, King Tywin is trying to uh, lure me into battle with himself, and I am not really up for that per se. Um, I mean, I'm tough, but come on, that's that's just oh, two more elite guys are gonna join me for my prisoners. If I can kind of lure Gregor Clegane away. Maybe I can uh, fight him on, on our own. I think that's far enough, don't you? Surely. Yeah. Sir Gregor Clegane. I hate this guy in the, in the books, in the movies, stories, TV, moving pictures on the screen that has magic gold things on it. Television series. <laughs> Anyway, Sir Gregor Clegane is a douche. Douche and a half. <laughs> he, uh, I just can't stand him. So I am going to kill you dead. I wish I could just kill this guy. I mean, literally kill him and take him out of the game. All right, here we go. You're mine, Gregor. If I remember correctly, it seems like I've seen him once before on the battlefield. And his character model is huge. They did a great job of representing him as a larger-than-life uh, character in the game. If I remember correctly. So let's, let's ride out to meet that guy. I bet that's him right there. He's a big old douche. Oh, yeah, look at him. He's big. He's a big one. He's a biggie. Biggie Smalls. He's a big old crybaby dead guy is what he's gonna be soon. Ooh. Yeah, come here, Gregor. Let's do a little one-on-one -on -one battle. Me against you. Cool guy against douche. Come on. Yeah, boy. Hi, guys. Yeah, that's what I thought, punks. You know, where's my guys at? I forgot to set them up in a proper position, didn't I? Let's put the archers on that hill. 
Let's get my cavalry to follow me. I can't remember uh, who it was. Someone commented on my video, recommended that I have my cavalry follow me, get them in a good position, and then have them charge in a flanking maneuver. Um, so I'm going to try that. That sounds like a good idea. I'm going to have them right over here. Whee! And then I'll have them flank these guys once they engage with my, uh, with my infantry. Alright, so come over here. Come over here, my cavalry boys. This guy. Alright, so won't you go charge into there. There we go. Yeah. I ain't scared of you. Oh. Yeah. Take some of that. Get you some of that, boys. Archers. You know what? I think I'm going to try. Uh, I got that great sword. That's like a... Uh, super good and uh, I don't usually use two-handed weapons but I think I may stop using the lance and just uh, try my hand at the at the great sword to see how I do I can see if I can do like a lot more damage on foot with it I'll just start doing that you know just uh, change up my playstyle a little bit kind of keep it fresh keeping it fresh for you guys heck yeah Sir Gregor Clegane is still out and about. Where is he? I figured he was dead by now. Oh, he's over there. Oh, he's a giant. He's a giant. No, don't. No. Don't equip the halberd. Did they get him? Ah, oh, I guess they got him. Too bad. I was wanting to fight him. So where's my masterwork arming sword that I dropped like an idiot? No, I guess I still got it. I just dropped my bow for this halberd. <laughs> Alright. Charge infantry. Okay. We got this mopped up. We got this in the bag. Just a bunch of archers and low level infantrymen. We got this. We got it. Yeah. No problem. No problem. Ah! I sure wish I could have faced Gregor Clegane in hand-to-hand -hand combat. I just completely forgot about him, to tell you the truth. That's how short-term my memory is. I saw him, I thought, you know what? Hand-to-hand -hand with Mr. Clegane. And then I got distracted doing my cavalry charge, which worked out really well, actually. I only had uh, six losses. Um, Billman. A couple Billman. Two of my mounted sergeants, which I don't care for. I, mean, I hate that I keep losing them, but I managed to escape. I wanted to take him prisoner. But overall, I, f I feel like that was really successful. And I'm really proud of you guys. And you just make me just so proud to be your master. Okay. Let's level my guys up. And... Boom. Got it. All right, so we got Gregor Clegane out of the out of the way for a little while anyway, and uh, let's get away from Keith Tywin here. I don't like you, no sir, no thanks. Uh oh, I don't have any food left. You know what that means? Time to go raid a village, get some more cattle. First, I'm going to drop in here. It seems like I have some food in storage here, and so uh, let me just see. No, not here. Oh, my destrier is healed up. So I was right. Uh, if you if you let your lame horses rest for a little while, apparently they they heal up, just like uh, your characters. So awesome. That is fantastic. Um, I want to do something right quick. I'm gonna I'm gonna try this great sword idea that I had. That's a great idea. <laughs> a great sword idea. <laughs> oh, lame. Okay. Um, let's see if I can get some, gr munch on some grindage. What's this guy have to say? 
block wool. Okay. I'm not sure what. Oh, here it is. Let's get a couple of fresh beefs here. That'll last me for a couple, couple of one or two days. Enough to go get some more food from a village. If I can get rid of King here, Kingy, King Taiwan, King Doofus, with your sideburns. Okay, I'm gonna try to sneak in to Lord Lord Haraway's town and get uh, get my prisoners out. So wish me luck. Okay, I'm gonna try to sneak into town. Wish me luck. Ah, uh, I always get caught. I don't know if it's because of my uh, my Boy, renown is that. too high Stop. or or what. <laughs> Come on, don't you know who I am? I am the king of Conceria. Bow before me, as your master will soon, King Tywin. He too will know the wrath of my sword as soon as I get as many troops as he has. <laughs> Alright, that's not too bad. Whee! Okay. Now let's see if we can break this guy out. Oh, prison. Oh, we got two guys, actually. Alright, so guys, you take those two guys. I'll take this guy. But I'm gonna go over here just in case. Alright, I wanna speak with a prisoner, give me the keys, blah blah blah. Alright, got the key. Okay, so let's go in here and free these guys. Bloodbeard! I've come to get you out of here. Thank the heavens, I don't know how long I could have lasted in here. <laughs> Alright. Um, I need you to grab a weapon. Sir Gerald Dang. What about Balakwo? Is he in here? Yeah, Balakwo's in here. You didn't even mention your friend. My friend. Alright, so I'll get Ger Sir Gerald Dane. I don't know what faction he fights for. Uh oh, he's a pretty boy. Thank the heavens! Alright. Let's go. Let's do this, boys. Let's do this. Now, I should be fully armed and armored. Right, get him. Get him. Got him. Come on. This guy is like blocking all my sword blows. <laughs> He's too standing too close to me. Stop it. Goober. Good grief. Tell you what. I'm gonna try out this two-handed blade here. Who is this? Sir Jill Dane, I like that. Oh yes. Got my boys out. I gained honor. And faction my relation with my own faction. <laughs> Alright. Maybe this should let him Yeah, he likes me a lot better now. Whenever I capture my next town, I think I'm going to give him the village. That way he becomes a lot more uh, loyal to me. I spent so much money on him. that. Alright, he is with the Reach. Awesome. And Stormlands like me as well. So I think I, next time I have a chance, I'm going to try to uh, propose another little alliance with the Reach. And maybe the Stormlands as well. I tried it not too long ago, and they turned me down, but I'll try it again. Okay, so here's some broken men. Dragonstone Longbowmen. I think I'll just trot on over here. I think Tywin is no longer... Uh, attacking or following me, so I'm gonna uh, come over here to Penny Tree. I think I've raided it once before, and I'm gonna take some stuff that I want from there, namely cattle. But I may, I may go ahead and I may loot the whole village just for money because I need money, man. Sorry, but I need money. 
It's expensive to be a king. I mean, look at this. I'm down to 12,000 gold already. 12,000 gold. I'm almost out of food. I just gotta see if I can do more. Oh, look. Look at this. 15 prisoners. Let me get this guy first. How fast is he? 5.2? Oh, I'll never catch him. Darn it. I hate being so big, though, because then you're slow. Alright, these guys hate me. I think I've raided it once before. Alright, so let's loot it. Looters. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, stop, stop. Run! <laughs> oh, King Tywin. He showed up. No, I don't. I gotta get away from King Tywin. Run away! Run away! Uh, Liz Riswell wants to see me again. I have got to marry that girl so that I can get that north on my side. I mean, do they automatically become my allies then? Or, I don't know. I've never gotten married in the game before. 215 versus 215. Ugh. Man, I tell you what. I am out of food again. See if I can recruit some more prisoners. I did. Cool. I guess you can only do it once per day. So. Ah, coffee. Oh, there was something else I wanted to try. That uh, somebody mentioned. I wanted to see if I could create a patrol and then hire that patrol into my troops. I don't know how much patrols cost and how much it'll be to hire them since I'm getting so low on money, but let's just see. Ah, I guess Bloodbeard got defeated again. Alright, so let's go in to the Lord's Hall. Get some more food and start a patrol. Oh, here's Bloodbeard. Hi. I have a new task for you. Um, follow me. Oh, he won't, huh? Interesting. Um, okay. Huh, I didn't know that was an option. That's neat. Okay, let's make a patrol. Um, let's get some recruits. Want to recruit some Veilman. Let's do 10. Okay, and let's do a patrol. I want to enlist a patrol, a small one. Where do you want to send the patrol? I will send them to uh, Sisterton. Yes. Okay, so then whenever I go up to see my lady, I'm going to see if I can get that patrol as well all right so now I need to get some food elf needs food badly uh-huh day old beef okay no not dismissed and let's get I'm gonna dispatch an emissary to stormlands send a gift non-aggression treaty I want to express my goodwill now I will send Sir Titus okay and I want to send an emissary to the reach um, I'd like to have a trade agreement Send horses for 3,000 coins. Send horses for 6,000 coins. Hand over a fee. Wow. Uh, no. <laughs> I do want to see if they'll do a trade agreement with him. And let's send Roderick. Okay. Okay. 
Oh, you can do a prisoner exchange. That's I keep forgetting about all these neat things you can do from here. Okay, so let's head. There's the patrol right there. Oh, cool. Awesome. Catch him. Catch him. He's fast. He's a fast little bugger. Where are you going? Okay, I got zero days of food left. Interesting. Okay, let's go visit our lady and see if I can catch this patrol. And I'll be right back. Okay, I came across a couple of battles here. Um, one is the Sister P Sisterton Patrol and the North fighting some raiders. And then there's also this caravan here. Now, if I jump in here and help uh, these guys, it'll be a super quick battle and super easy. It's only 15 guys, but it'll raise my relation with the North, and it will also uh, give me an opportunity to maybe grab that patrol and get another 30 guys in my my hire here. So let's kill these raiders. Yeah, that's what I thought. Raider archers. Oh, he shot me right before I shot him. Or, I <laughs> shot him. Right before I stabbed him. Yeah, these guys are just fodder. War fodder. I want to test out my new great sword. Hello! Wow, look at this thing. It's crazy. <laughs> look at the size of this sword. Jeez. It's nuts. Okay. We won. Alright, so Theomore Smallwood likes me. Thank you. You're welcome. Alright. Let's upgrade these guys. And then we'll be in good shape. And we can attack the um, caravan here. Oh, wait. Where's the Sisterton patrol at? Where'd it go? Did it, like, despawn or something? Oh, there it is. Okay. Return from a mission to the Stormlands. Okay. He had, oh, I guess I never... Uh, did the the thing with him to um, get the Stormlands to acknowledge my right to rule. I thought I had done all the major factions. I guess I didn't. Okay, great. Okay, so now I'm going to attack this caravan, which will be good because I need some food. Badly. Elf needs food. Badly. I wish the... Uh, this, that would be really cool, except that it chops off part of the sword there. Maybe that's supposed to represent where it's attached to my scabbard on my back, maybe, I don't know. It kind of cuts part of the sword off. It makes it look weird. Like it's embedded in my back. I got a sword tattooed into my back! It's surgically enhanced. Alright. Time for you guys to meet Betsy, the Great Sword. Oh God! It's destroyed his shield, man. Nice. Oh, awesome. Nice. I should have been using a two-handed weapon all along. This thing is radical. I may go up and do that uh, Knight's Watts mission with this sword. See if I can chew through some wildlings. 
I guess I'll be up here north anyway, so might as well try it. Victory! Alright, that was easy enough. No casualties. Alright. Uh, thank you. Alright, I guess I can't really take any prisoners. I'm gonna get... Oh, really? No food? Jeez. Alright, so let's see if I can get this sister gen patrol here. Alright. Please disband. I want to give some troops to you. I need you to reinforce a garrison. Can I take them? Sweet! Thank you. Uh, can't. Re I'll have to look up your name and give you credit uh, at the end of the video, but um, thank you for that tip. That is a fantastic tip. I couldn't take all of them, but I could take some of them. So I wonder if I can do this. I can't take the elite longbowman for some reason. But, that was a really good tip. Thanks, guy. Thank you very much. Alright. So, I got me some knights, and heavy knights. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Kudos to you, my friend. Kudos to you. Need you to reinforce a garrison at... Dairy. Okay. So thank you very much for that tip. That worked out perfectly. You are a gentleman and a scholar. Ah, oh, I am hurting for money though. Look at that. 7,000 coins for my for my troops and my party. And tons of food needed. Buy some supplies? Nope. Can I buy some cattle? Uh, let's go talk to the village elder and see if we can buy some cattle from here. I need food so bad. Alright, I want to buy some supplies. I want to buy cattle. 500 heads of cattle, each for 51 coins. Let's give me five. All right. I'm gonna buy five more. Okay. Sweet. Okay. So now I've got 10 herd of cattle. I'm gonna slaughter two of them. All right. And then I want to tell the rest of them to follow me. Follow me to Barrington. Alright, actually, let's go to Blazewater Bay first. And, uh, hmm. Recruiters brought 10 recruits to Derry. Sweet! It actually worked for once, instead of him getting killed. Oh man, they eat so much food. Eat so much food. How much food do I have left now? Okay, let's recruit some more peasants. Alright, doing good there. Um, 3200 for Kevin, sure. Alright, so let's see if we can... Okay, he's returned from the Reach. He's not willing to sign a trade agreement. Well, bully on him. Let's recruit some more prisoners. Two heavy Westerlands knights? Yeah! Yeah, I'll take them. Heck yeah. Morale is so easy to bring back up. You just win a couple battles and you're good to go. Alright, so let's um let's go visit our lady. And then I'll strongly, strongly consider going up and doing the uh the little mission for the Night's Watch. Because I know there is a really cool weapon called the Dark Sister. It's a it's a single-handed sword. I think it's a bastard sword. And so, uh, it's a really good weapon to have your for your single-handed combat. And so, 
uh, I think we'll do that. Sell that stuff. That was a terrible little um, caravan we found. It's poor. All they have is tools. Tools. I'm just like some tools. All right, Northern Levy, and let's visit my lady. Let's visit Alice. Hi, Alice. Okay, she's up to 17. Oh, come on. Um. Oh, she's up to 18. Okay. Uh, okay, so you see that still? Should I try to push it? Persuasion opportunity relation required for automatic success 20. Chance of success 0. Oh, no. At least it gives me a warning that I'm gonna about to lose a relation with her. Okay, so I guess that's about all the time I have for today. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, throw me some likes, leave me some comments, and subscribe to my channel, and share this video. It really helps me out when people share, because I, I need to uh, get my name out there and let people know I'm making these awesome videos. <laughs> so if you liked it, please share it with your friends, and your family, and your neighbors, and the people you go to school with, and your co-workers, and the President of the United States, and the President of some other country, and the Prime Minister of Great Britain, and the Prime Minister of Germany, and all of their friends, and their neighbors, and their roommates, and your dog walker. I will see you guys next time. Bye.